Hey everybody, it's Mac Thompson with Tech Running 24 7. And today I want to do a quick video on how to create a custom watch face for your Moto 360. And as you can see here, I have my Moto 360. It's a silver with the uh, tan wristband and it's uh, on its uh, charging dock. And so I want to show you a little bit of how to do custom watch faces for it. So with your phone, we're going to take my phone, my Galaxy Note 4, and you want to load this app here. It's called Intellicom Watch Faces, Intellicom Watch Faces. So you want to go to the Play Store and load that. I believe it's free. I started using this about a week ago and, you know, did some some trial and error type stuff with it and came up with some watch faces and wanted to share, share with you how to do it. So after cutting it on, we're going to cut it on real quick. And in this app, you have some preloaded watch faces. And as you can see there, that's the uh, round navigator. <laughs> round navigator watch face. And if you hit your watch face, if I tap it, well, let me just pick it up and activate it here. If I tap it, you'll see that's the uh, round navigator. It's the round navigator style there. So we can put it there. And if you, uh, it has a whole different list of different ones that you can do, you know, that are already made up templates. But I want to show you a couple of them that I've done. And the thought I had in mind when I did these, I thought I'd make one with my YouTube channel logo. And I'd make one from my um, college alumni. So I'm going to share with you those, how those look. And if you hit load faces and it has the two that I've already made up, I'm going to show you my YouTube logo. And that's how it looks. I thought it came out really well. And uh, the way you sync it to the phone, if you hit that tab there, let me go back. I'm sorry. Hit the tab there and say uh, sync to watch. Now, hopefully it'll show right. It's been kind of um, looking a little different because of the lighting in my limited camera um, equipment I have here. And so as it goes off, that's closer to how it actually looks. It looks more like it does on the watch screen. I guess it's just that ambient light. They're kind of throwing it off with the camera. And then the other log, the other uh, watch face I did, I've done is for my college. Um, let me go back up here and load the faces. Load the faces. I'm sorry. This is one for uh, Southwestern Christian College, and it, I thought it came out really well, also. And that's how it actually does look on the uh, watch. We're gonna sync it to the watch and see if we can get it to appear to look like this on camera. But like I said, with the backlight on the watch, it's kind of throwing it off because I'm shooting this video with my older phone. And, uh, of course, video quality will get better as I do more videos, hopefully. But as it goes off there, that's close. That's how it actually looks in person when you get that image right there. But anyway, uh show you something real quick how to... Do a quick face. And what I decided to do was I went and got a little YouTube image. And I took my, well, excuse me, YouTube, the YouTube icon itself. And I took my YouTube channel image and kind of merged them to see if we can kind of put together something. And the way we would do that, first what we would do is I'd go to one of the templates. we we'll go to load, watch face. And we're going to go to one of the templates. We're going to go with the um, minimal list. And that's one of the stock designs. And I went with that because it's got mostly black background. And so then you can start customizing it. Like I said, I've already created like a little picture I want to use for my background. So you hit that menu there uh, for background. I'm going to show you some different backgrounds you can do with that minimalist design. But we're going to use custom. Say OK. And then we're going to hit that right there and go to our gallery and uh, pull up. 
pull up uh, what we want to use. Let's see if I can find a picture here. Let's go back here. Right there, that's what I want to use. So I've created that little pic, and it's of the YouTube icon itself and my Tech Running 24 7 logo. We can move this box down so it can kind of be centered on the watch how we kind of want it. Then we go down to the bottom here and hit finish and return. <clears throat> and as you can see, it added it to the circle there as you're going to create your, your own personal design for your watch face. So next what we would do is go down to the numbers. I don't think I want to put numbers on here. I think I'm just going to put markers. Let's go to the markers. It's like... Uh, Got hour marker, minute mark, and alignment. Let's go with the hour markers. Let's go with um, I don't know triangles. And as you see, he put little triangles on there. And uh, let's go with let's also do minutes. Let's see minutes. We'll make it a um, small. And it made little small markers on there, as you can see, little small white markers. And so the little triangle, the triangles are like numbers like 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And the little, little dots are kind of like the seconds in between the minutes. Well, actually, the uh, smaller minutes. So when you go from 12 to 5, so that's, the little dots are like 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's do something a little different too. Let's change the color on the minutes. Let's make it uh I don't know. Let's yeah, let's go with the red. Hopefully I can do this right here. And as you see, that's cool. Maybe uh markers around that red. Now let's go on down to the clock hands. And choose something for the clock hands, let's say hour hands. And they got different shapes of the hour hand. You can go with let's go with this one. And as you see it's in white there. The white hands. Let's so let's change up those hands and give them a different color. Let's go with this green. As you can tell, that's probably one of my my favorite colors. And so now you see the green, the, the white hands are green. Okay, and then after the hands, you can go with widgets. We can go with widgets. Let's see. Let's go with a right widget. A, uh, yeah, right widget. Let's make it Friday. I mean, as you can see, you put FR for Friday there. And... Uh, Let's go with a uh, right widget and make it the date. And so to put it there, and actually, you can hit this here and uh, move it. I think that's the, uh oh, move the Friday back, wrong spot. Let's go back, cancel. The day. Oh, I see. You slide that toggle back and forth. Let's move it. Let's set it there. And let's just bring it down just right there in that gray. Okay. And then let's go over to the uh, date widget. Again, got that. And we're going to move it down. Uh, we don't want the size to get bigger. We want to move it over. Just like that. So that works out pretty cool. Let's uh, also... Uh, we'll leave it like that. Let me see. I'm looking for another... For the widgets. Maybe change the style. Yeah, let's change the style. Let's make the style boxed. See how I put a box around the uh, Friday and the date of the 20th. 
So that's pretty cool. Let's go down. Anything else we want to do? I guess that's about it. So that is the style of our watch face. It says YouTube and then tech running 24 seven. Now all we have to do is really is go back over here and say sync to watch face. And let's check our watch to see, move the phone here, if it actually carried over. And uh, yes, it did. Still not kind of focusing real well with our camera. But it looks really good. Like I said, as it goes off, that's how it appears in person. A whole lot better there and it looks just like just like that but our lighting and camera equipment is not as good as we would like but anyway that's our video for today on how to create a custom watch face for the Moto 360 hopefully uh, you learned some uh, from the video please comment and share and most of all please subscribe Thanks.